Musketeers and welcome back to my channel. Please pardon my appearance. I am not wearing anything. I'm not nail polish, not makeup, not nothing. I've been kind of on a whirlwind of a past couple weeks. I went to Disney World and then I flew back to LA to go on a camping trip with my students for a week and then oh, I'm flying back to Connecticut in like an hour. So everything's crazy. So I look a little different, but whatever. I thought I would film a haul for you. I just went to Disney World. So really quickly, I'm gonna go through all the things that I got on my Disney trip. So if you wanna see what I got, stay tuned. All right, I'm gonna get started with this. It's gonna be short and sweet. So first things, let's start with freebies. Did you know that Splash Mountain has bags for your electronics? I did not, but I was really excited. They say have a zippity doo dah day and they're sponsored by Ziploc. Love that product placement. Get that money, Disney. So yeah, I took a bunch of these. Ahem. Another freebie that I got was this passport for the International Flower and Garden Festival at Epcot. I was able to go and taste some of the things that they had. You just get some stickers and you put them in your passport. So love that. I also got a lei from Ohana. Now, again, these things are free, but Ohana's a pretty expensive restaurant, but I got a lei, let's put it on. Cute. I also got to do the Pirates of House fireworks cruise from the Contemporary. My cousin Rob set it up for us. It was so, so fun. So a couple freebie things from there. Um, oh, one's missing. Oh, no, no. <laughs> so I got these gold doubloons. Is that what they're called? But I got these chocolate gold coins. They have the skull and crossbones on the front of them and then on the back they say dead men tell no tales. So I took a bunch and put them in one of the free Ziplocs. We also got bandanas just for being on it. They're so cute. They say pirates and pals, fireworks, voyage. Um, they have a little, is that Captain Hook? Yeah, it's Captain Hook and Smee. Um, speaking of, I'm really angry. We took pictures there and they didn't show up on my magic band. So I keep checking my Disney experience and I'm really upset. Anyone knows how to deal with that and get our pictures back? I don't know. I'm just so sad. I had a cute outfit and I didn't take any other pictures because I thought, well, we're going to get a photo pass picture, but whatever. Now I think that's all my free items. Let's move on to the things that I actually bought. Now, if you're new here, I get ears on every one of my trips. These are my ears from this trip. It was Flower and Garden Festival, so I thought all my outfits would be kind of florally, springy themed, and I got these ears, so they're just the flower Mickey Minnie Mouse ears, and they're so cute. I kind of wish there was a bow, but these are my ears for this trip. I got some Disney pens. These are cute. They're just kind of classic looking. They have the castle. It says most magical place on earth. A set of six pens. And I got this pen, which is this slinky dog pen. It looks really similar to the Pluto one, but it says Toy Story here is a slinky dog pen. And I also got myself a really pretty ring. I'm going to try and beauty guru this. I have a Mickey Mouse ring that I get a lot of compliments on and people don't even notice that it's Mickey Mouse. I wanted like a thumb ring. So I got this one. Can we see? If not, I'll just insert a picture. It's really cute and it has little Mickey head silhouettes and then, you know, crystals. So, love that. I also got my dad this pirate hat. <laughs> um, he loves pirate stuff, so I told him I'd get him something. It says, the beatings will continue until morale improves. Now, that's a very Bruce hat. My dad's name is Bruce. He always says, like, I shall beat the daughter. He doesn't actually do it, but it's always, like, his joke. Oh, someone needs a beating. He's joking. He's, like, being all medieval. But this just really suits his personality, so I hope that he likes it. And the last bit of stuff I got was from Basin. Now, I don't usually go to Basin, but my sister wanted the shampoo bar and the conditioner bar. So I brought myself in there, and I got her Oops, the grapefruit... Uh, shampoo bar and uh, conditioner bar and then I got myself one too. I've never tried a shampoo bar and a conditioner bar so I'm kind of excited to try. She loved it when we got it on our last trip so I got her some of that. Um, I don't usually go into the store because I'm not really big on bath products but I'm kind of in this like lifestyle right now of trying to like really take care of myself whether that's eating healthy and working out or taking care of my skin and I don't know maybe it's like a late quarter life crisis I don't know but 
I got some stuff for myself too. I got these bath bomb marbles. They're just kind of smaller versions of bath bombs. These ones are lavender and those are watermelon scented. And then I also got myself two soaps, which I'm not gonna open for you, but they are, one is like a floral scent, one's watermelon, and they both have Mickey heads in them because why would you get soap from Basin with, if it didn't have Mickey heads in it? So these are just like your basic bath soaps that I will try and use. Oh, I have one more thing that I keep forgetting that I got. Oh, and then. I also got a new refillable mug. So I got this one, it's black. And then it has all these different types of Mickeys on them. So I thought this was adorable. It kind of goes through all the different iterations of Mickey Mouse, whether it's the Mickey ice cream bar or Mickey in the cartoons. But I just thought this one was adorable and I got it and you know, made my money's worth, went back and forth to get coffee and drinks and water. And I just love a refillable mug because I get to use them at home too. Well, I think that's all for my Disney haul. I told you it was gonna be short and sweet. Thank you so much for staying tuned with me. I know I've been kind of like in this weird place of life right now, and I'm trying to get back into my sense of self and the things that I'm passionate about. And I really appreciate you guys being patient with me. I'm trying to get back into my YouTube channel. I really love doing it, and I'm just trying to get myself into that mental place. So thank you so much for being patient with me. I appreciate every single one of you who watches my videos and I don't know, you just mean the world to me. So I hope you enjoyed this haul. Stay tuned. I do have footage from my last trip that I got all this stuff on with my family and I did a bunch of experiences that I've never done before. So I'm kind of looking forward to editing those. So hopefully I'll get back into the swing of things. But thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Bye. These is extra magic moments. Jesus, extra magic moments. I look freaking crazy. <sighs> I'm also very full. Oh, and maybe I haven't. I've been sleeping in a tent <sighs> with a hundred children. And I'm sick from Disney. Oh, well. Okay. Good job. Good job, team. Goodbye. No, my friends, we can't